Hey guys, what's up? It's Mr. Ninja here. Today we are playing a game called Would You Rather. Now, basically, the, name, the way this game works is you choose one of two options. Would you rather this or would you rather that? And then you see the popularity of uh, whether one is more popular or the other one is more popular. The cool thing about this game, though, is that it puts you in some pretty tight situations. So you guys can see exactly how awful of a person I am. Or... Good of a per great of a person I am. I don't really know. Uh, we'll see how many different worlds we can destroy uh, before dying tragically. <laughs> Anyways, for the first one here is: Would you rather produce a low-budget film on your with your best friends and have the time of your life, or produce a Hollywood blockbuster with people you detest and make a ton of money? Hmm. So either I can have the best time of my life with my best friends because I have tons of best friends or I could produce a Hollywood blockbuster with people I don't like and make a ton of money the, the difference between this and the reason I say this is because I can either make a ton of money which will last or have one time in my life I enjoy unless if I die that day <laughs> I'm gonna have to say, make a ton of money. Oh, okay, so I, I, I'm ahead. So we have 53% uh, of them agree with me, which which is good. Um, but but logically speaking, having a good time is great. But I don't think I could have the time of my life making a video once. <laughs> I mean, maybe tons of videos and all my life type of stuff. I mean, if this was every day of my life, make a ton of money and be with people you don't like, it's still a lot of money and I could still have fun afterwards. So, yeah. Okay, so here we go. Would you rather have a British accent or an Australian accent? Oh, no, not this one. I think they're both hot. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to be realistic here. I really like both a lot girls with British and accents and uh, British accents and Australian accents <laughs> um, hmm. I'm just gonna have to go with my gut and say oh boy, I don't know I'm gonna have to say Australian maybe okay okay more people like British apparently so I, I just get two-thirds of the women <laughs> anyways but no I, I don't know um I, I, I actually prefer if I could have a personal accent myself. I think I'd like. Uh, also, eh, I think I would like Australia more, but British would be kind of cool. To be completely fair, though, I would probably like Scottish more than any of them. Um, would you rather absolutely reek of armpits for the rest of your life, or lose your sense of smell completely? Okay, so this is basically. So, uh, if, if I had, you know, a reek of armpit smell, eventually I would get used to it. And I wouldn't smell it anymore. So, I'd still be able to smell things, but this is kind of a, would I rather pick something for me or pick something for everyone else? Now, if I am entirely by myself and isolated from the rest of the world, I would definitely choose lose your sense of smell. I mean, lose your, lose your... Uh, Rico armpits. But losing my sense of smell, that also includes taste. Oh, I have to reek. I'm sorry, I'm gonna reek. <laughs> See, but you get used to it over time. And whoever you're with would probably get used to it too if they could deal with you long enough. Anywho, <laughs> would you rather eat fruit roll ups or eat fruit by the foot? Okay, okay, are you, are you talking like by my physical feet or like a foot of fruit? I'm not entirely sure. Um, fruit loops are pretty good. Uh, fruit, fruit rolls are pretty good. I'm just gonna go with fruit rolls because why not? Uh, there's, there, there's like no downside to this. <laughs> okay, all right. If you died, would you rather have your brain transplanted into a robot. <laughs> oh, that would be cool. <laughs> or have your brain transplanted, transplanted into the opposite sex. 
That would also be kind of cool. Oh, this is hard. Um, transplant into a robot would be really cool, and you'd live forever. If you're transplanted to the opposite sex, you would eventually die. But then again, your brain only survives 120 years, approximately. The brain is the one thing you can't replace in your body anyway, so... Uh, hmm. I don't know. I, I, if I were to live forever, it would definitely be robot. But if I'm gonna be logical about this, I'm gonna have to go with the opposite sex because why not? It'd be kind of fun, you know? Even if it's only a couple more years of your life, it's still, it'd be kind of fun. Unless you die like infant and then you're just immediately the opposite sex, which isn't terrible. I mean, you get to live a whole life still, right? <laughs> All right, would you rather marry a hardened criminal or marry someone with five kids from three previous marriages? Oh my goodness, five kids. Oh, I don't think I could deal with five kids again. I have nine siblings for anyone who, who <laughs> pays any attention to uh, my Omega. Uh, <laughs> whew. Uh, I'm going to have to go with a hardened criminal. I, I don't think I could deal with that many kids. I'm sorry. Like, if I love the person, great. But that's a lot of kids. That's a lot of kids. <laughs> oh, boy. Would you rather cut off your right hand or cut off your left hand? Mm, this must be in a really bad circumstance. <laughs> and would, would I be talented enough to start doing things with my left hand? <laughs> I'm gonna have to cut off my left hand. Oh, but that's my keyboard hand. I can figure out everything else with my right hand. Uh, I'm gonna cut off my left hand. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, and I'm right-handed. It's 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 not even fair. I mean, realistically, I'm just I'm right-handed. That's how it works. <laughs> Okay, would you rather eat Nutella or eat bacon? Oh, bacon. I know, everyone goes, Nutella's the greatest dub on earth, but <laughs> bacon. Bacon. Mmm. Bacon. Okay, would you rather have an expensive, have all expenses paid, all, all expenses, I can't say the word today, have all expenses paid two month vacation in France, or be on the moon for one hour. Okay, here's a question. I, that's not even a question. Why, why would I not go to France? It's two months. Whereas being on the moon, even if you were to compare, you know, oh, the moon's really cool, it's only an hour. And it doesn't say they gave me an oxygen tank, just saying. <laughs> but. If it were longer, like two months of either one, I might go to the moon, but I'd rather go to France for two months. There's actually people there. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a 50-50 draw. Whoa. I mean, France is slightly ahead, but still. Wow. Then again, if you lived in France, there'd be no point in France for two more months. So, you know. For the rest of your life, would you rather, oh my goodness, for the rest of my life, have all the superpowers you want, but always be alone? Oh my goodness. Or be a normal person, but popular. Man, this is an introvert versus extrovert question. What kind of things could I do? See, like, the superpower I would want would be the ability to create anything and everything. God, but still, superpower to do everything or be normal. I'm already decent to my friends, but I don't know if I can create another person. But that would mean I can't create another person because it kind of. Kind of I think I go with the superpowers because I, it sounds cool. You know why? Why shouldn't I? I, I don't know. I'm going to go with superpowers just because it sounds more logical to me. Uh, but it seems like a lot of people do want to see other people. So, uh, you know, weigh, weigh, your, weigh your odds here. Um, <laughs> anyway, would you rather 
eat 50 chicken nuggets or six Big Macs. Neither one of them would fill me up, first off. Um, I'd probably have to go with the six Big Macs. I don't really eat at- oh, this is- oh, this is- Big Macs is specifically McDonald's, though. 50 chicken nuggets isn't specifically McDonald's. I'm not a fan of McDonald's. I might have to go with- I actually would prefer not eating either, but- Cause I'm pretty healthy, but... I'm gonna have to go with the 50 chicken nuggets, I think. Yeah, I, I don't know, I just... Six Big Macs, like, I'm trying to think on how big that is. It's not very big. I mean, Big Macs are tiny little things, so... I don't know. Alright, would you rather have to get around at all four all the time, or only make animal noises? So, walk like a creature, or sound like a creature? Get on all fours, what would the advantage be to that? Eventually, it would learn to run really fast, like Tarzan. Or, I'd only make animal noise, or, oh yeah, only make animal noises. I think I would rather run on all four, because... <laughs> I mean, yeah, I could purr like a cat. That would be really cool, but realistically, no one else can communicate with you. And then they're just like, well, well why are you walking all four? I was cursed by a witch. She, she cursed me to walk on all four or make animal noises. I don't think you want me named like a horse. <laughs> Anyways, off of that subject. Would you rather never touch a computer again? Oh my goodness. <laughs> never touch a person of the opposite sex. Oh no! No! Not this one! I like computers. And I'm a touchy person. <sighs> so, we're gonna let you guys answer this one. So, uh, tell me down below in, your in the comments. Below, if you would rather never touch a computer again, and that mean you never watch me again. You don't have to touch the computer. Oh, oh, there's there's an advantage. I'm just giving you a little advantage here. You don't have to touch the person and touch the computer to see it. You just can't ever play games again. That's basically hell. Um, or never touch another person. Ooh, that's really hard. So definitely tell me down below in the comments and make sure to leave a double ones up down below if you like to see here uh this is the first time i've done this so if you guys want to see more i definitely want to know give me as many likes as you want and comment down below if you like it and if uh what you would choose here because this is a really hard decision and i don't want to make it <laughs> so i'll see you in the next one bye bye i'm shooting my kitchen now liberate him to fill him with love <laughs> Oh, you've been loved! Yeah! After smashing... Oh! He did it!